Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. This is episode 96 of Final Fantasy 12, and we just finished off the boss in this game. I think, uh, let us move the equipment back to the black belt. Or let's keep the bubble belt on. Yeah, let's keep the bubble belt on. It has worked for us very well. Uh, now, where do we go from here? Can we access this again? By this, return to the gate of earth. By other means, return E back to this place. I guess, yeah, we... Okay, okay, so we are back out. And where is the... Where's that guy? Where's Daedalus? Okay, where is Daedalus? What happened to him? So we can come back here for... Uh, for Ultima. I mean... That is a choice we can uh, we can agree on. The Great Crystal Crystal Cave, Girovegan. Yes, let's overwrite that. And I think. Okay, where are we supposed to go from here? <laughs> no idea. Okay, uh, let's check on the world map. So we're in Girovegan. Oh. Okay, let's check what we can find out in. Because we can always port here, right? Anytime. Teleport to Balfonheim. Where's Balfonheim? Uh, what? Oh yeah, portal balls one time. I hope they uh, upgraded the kind of spells we can buy. Okay. Uh... Yeah, yeah, let's see what you have. See what he has. Oh, these are all the old stuff. High potion. We don't need high potion. We need the X potion now. Oh, nothing. No new improvement? Okay. Oh, he's selling teleport stones. That's good. That's good to know. So we don't have to waste our time uh, farming low level. Low level silver wolves once we uh, pass that. the merchant that sells the uh, magics oh this guy yes arise uh, what is that uh, fully restore the HP oh yes 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 wow that's expensive shop uh, they deal heavy down to one fall graviga reduce HP all foes in range by half Ouch. Darka. No. 
NFTs. Oh, okay. Uh, what can we sell? Teleport stone, earth stone. Uh oh. This means uh, there's a bunch of uh, farming time being asked of us going into this because dark crystal okay at least we got something oh not even close it's just enough to pay for one one spell ah wind crystal Storm Crystal. Insect Hulk. Orgain scent, uh, iron ore, mithril, Marlboro flower. Wow, where can we get more of this? Uh, not of rust, ether. No, 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 we're, uh, why are we looking at even that? We're not selling those things. Phoenix Flight, Gaiga's Gear. Is anyone worth their well, test? Highly prized on the battlefield. Soul of the Firebird. Smelling salts, matching reds. I don't know what this Gaiga's Gear does, but it's presumably for for the uh, oh these are the guy this is the guy who sells gambits yes Target aim with uh, I don't know what these you know the lowest ones maybe uh, we can do like maybe that's time to poach them Completing all the uh, all the gambits, so that uh, I don't know what these. Wow, these are all expensive. Uh, full character. are finishing our gambits you know what might as well just buy everything there's so few left already
guess that's it, right? I think we bought everything there is. I think we bought everything there is. Okay. Uh, what's this guy doing? Oh, power. What are the things we don't have? Uh, sleep. Uh, disable. He doesn't have the bubble, huh? Bango. Yes, this is what we want. There are some situations where magic is not... Oh, we want... Let's assume we want to cast... Uh, put reflect on our character. Or like a reflect uh, armor. On uh, like bash. So that means the only way to heal him would be with X potions. Back to swine. Uh, oh, that's for this one. We need another five of this because it's see blind, poison, silent, slow from one ally. This is such wow, it's 400. Ouch. Ah, oh, Princess Kiss. Ouch. All of these things that cost money. Like echo herbs, it's it's better to use uh, and uh, potions <coughs> rather than wait for Pen Penelo to do that, right? And also eye drops, so that we just uh, she will concentrate on like I think the X potions, uh, but right not right now, not right now. Okay, uh, I think we can we can buy more X potions. Where, where is the, uh, where's the armor? Oh, here's the armor. No, this is the Gambit guy. You know what? Let's just go to the meeting place first. And find out uh, because there's another cutscene. Yeah, let's just go to the meeting place. Uh, These are techniques. Because uh, let's get through the real storyline and then we'll decide what, what we want to do next. Enter the mines. The governor expects good behavior from all his guests if you go. Governor. Governor. Ships in the water. Send fishing dories if need be. I care not. Gloss air engines are as good to us as sky to a fish. Leave what boats have foundered. I want soul saved, not driftwood. Our armada ran afoul of bad water near the Ridderana Cataract. All engines stopped a sudden. Becalmed. Trouble with a mist thick as death, it seems. Those seas are yacht. I expected airship trouble, not a fleet foundering midst the waves. Tell me of what happened in Giruvagon. From the lay of your eyes, I measure all did not go well. Sid, was he false as I feared? Yes, but we may have caught a glimpse of his true intent. We may now know what it is that Sid searches for. So the day-affected Nithocite was only a fragment? 
And these Ocuria I know not and care to know even less. If we strike this sun crest with the sword of kings, no new stone may be born. We say the sun crest is the source of all Nethesite's power. If we might break it, the dusk shard would be as a thing lifeless. As for the manufactured Nethesite, who can say? There is another way. We use the treaty blade to cut a new stone from the crest. Use that to fight the dusk shard and the manufactured stones. Would you like to know the best use of Nethesite? Will or nil, I'll tell you. You pick it up and throw it away. Either way, we have to find the sun crest first, right? Don't we? Across the sea, and a tower on a distant shore. Rethys? Familiar words, Vaughn. I saw something of the sort written in some documents I chanced upon during my visit to Draclaw. The Naldoan Sea, the Ridderana Cataract, and the Pharos Lighthouse. I sent my fleet to fish out the truth behind these words, and caught trouble. Then proof is ours. This lighthouse on the Naldoan Sea is the tower on the distant shore. The strong mist that becalmed your ships is a grimmer yet clearer sign than any we might hope for. The Suncrest is there. All well and good, but how do we get there? Those seas are in Yacht, as I recall. Try putting this one in your ship. It is a sky stone made to resist Yacht. Oh! More spoils from the Draclaw labs, is it? Why not use it yourself? That's just the thing. My ship's a Bergerpen model. It will not work. But, should it fit the Strahl, she'll fly in Yacht. Lady Ash, I would accompany your highness, if you do not object. I am in your care. But tell me one thing. Why do so much for us? The Nabudis Deadlands. Nabudis was your home? Nay, but a memory forever burned in my heart. As a guest? Oh, so we are now four. Ah, it is you. Have you heard? Our ship sent to the Pharos have foundered. Thankfully enough, it were just as the fishing skulls came home. We sent them out straight away. Ridoran, the great Pharos and the bottomless cataract. No man of Balfonheim would willingly go there. So oft are we warned as children. But Redas is no man of Balfonheim. There were many against this expedition, but he, he knew no fear. You make for the Great Pharos. That place is in Jack. You know, you will not be able to fly there. There you are. The repairs on the Strahl are complete, Kupo. You can leave whenever you want from the Aerodome. Kupo, you have a Sky Stone that can fly in Jack. Put it right in the straw bed. Can now travel through the jack. Okay. Cool. Ah, that's a spot of good fortune. That new sky stone should ease your journey considerably. Now you know the way. The forest tower on a distant shore stands on an island at the Ridoran Cataract. In the Jack Naldoan South Seas over here. Take care. So we are going to the air dome. Let's reckon. Uh, oh, there is the. Uh, okay, I see the. Uh, I see the, the weapon shop. Yes. This is Edo's Techniques. This is the weapon shop. You know, what we should do is save the game and then find out what is being sold at the um, bazaar. And then if we find a good one, or is the similar, I think we can always get a good bargain in that one. Uh, this one is 92. 
Wow, this is wind stuff, and I think uh, it's an improvement on Van. Van Asabushi can use this, and it has uh, wind. Wow, this is not bad. Uh, Yoichi Bow, that's good for Fran. He is already equipped with it. And we did not pick this one up because Fran's current <coughs> excuse me current pole has a uh, wind to it uh, rune blade no yeah okay zephyr pole no these are all penetrator C O. Oh. what's the penetrator crossbow 79 for us the 96 we might want a van to get right there into the into the thick of things now and then for the spica oh wait only only i think what only the bow or oh, new at uh, the bazaar see that's what uh we should check what this one is uh not a wooden pole, but iron forged bowl, pole. Simple pole made of iron. Its end is stained with dried blood. Gaiga's gear. That's the one that I was uh, thinking of. Forgotten Grimoire. Text dating from antiquity. This prescribing te tactics and guidance to those who would walk a path. Obtain the Knight's monograph. Wow, that was a huge purchase. Oh, see, see, that's the one, the Gaigas. Remember, they were selling Gaigas chest plate, light armor. Wow. Okay, I think we. Oh, only the chest plate is plus six. So apparently, what? Ash has on is better. Celebrants miter. So what we found actually in the great giant crystal is actually better. Chakra brand band. I think we we found that too. Okay. Uh, so the Gaiga's plate is ten thousand. That alone, right? If we buy from the bazaar. That's 17. We only need one. Because the hat is no improvement as far as... As far as Ash is concerned. And also as far as Penelo is concerned. And as far as... Uh, Fran is concerned. No. Uh, no, we don't want to do that. Okay. Um, Celebrant's Miter. I think this one we need to buy. Chakra. That's a level 9. This is a level 8 power vest. No. Oh, no. Oh, that is what... Uh... So we can just buy the Gaiga's chest plate. Or we can buy the guy because, because if we buy the set, it's seventeen thousand. But if we just buy individually, it's twenty one thousand four hundred. So we actually do get a uh, bonus. Uh, Hypno crown. What is this? We never have this. What what does this do? Hypno crown. Defense is 50. We want to buy this for Pinello. Jade Crown. Uh, Magic Resist. So.
So this has a magic resist of 50 and what we Pinello is wearing is already 56. Wow. Oh, we don't have Kaiser Shield. We don't have anything that's better for it. So the only thing of interest for me at this point in time is the Cleric's Robe. Oh, she cannot wear it yet? Okay, uh, hold on. Uh, licenses, Cleric's Robe. Oh, Shem Hazai has been added. Should we give that to uh, to Pinello? No, no. Let's have the cleric's robe first. And then let's equip her. Gaia gear is plus 47 in defense, but we'll drop her magic by 50, increase her health by 150. Whereas the cleric's robe will increase her magic power by one, defense to 50. Wow, we want another mages, uh, sage's ring. the white mask that we found oh that's level 11 oh no wonder it is way ahead okay anyway uh, our timer went off so i guess this would be a good place to cut the episode right here uh thank you guys for uh, joining me i hope you will join me in the next episode bye